Hey guys, it's the Mama Boss, and I'm here today, and I'm playing, I mean, I'm doing, um, sand art. So this is pretty much, I my camera cut off, and this is what I was pretty much doing, and there's like different colors, right there, and there's green, there's pink. So we're gonna use all those colors, and right now I'm using the, <clears throat> I'm using the design of a heart. There's a heart, there's a star. A shooting star, a triangle shaped one, a twisted one, there's two of the twisted ones, and one that looks like a like a diamond kind of. And I already have the supplies here, so I already got started in this one. The way you're supposed to use it is use a funnel to put in the sand. And you're supposed to hang this on a wall, so is the shooting star because they have this hole here. But the shooting star has a star, not like a circle like this one. And then I picked my two colors, blue and purple. And I'm going to tilt it right here so you guys can see better of what I'm doing. So, I am going to use blue now since I already used purple. I'm going to use blue. And I'm going to cut it right here. So I'm going to put in the funnel and put in the sand art. If that's enough. It's more than a purple, but I mean it's okay, right? Now back to the purple. The purple. Make sure that the sand doesn't come out like I did, like this happened. So I'm gonna pour in some. It's gonna take a pretty long time because the blue one had a bigger hole than this purple one that I'm using. Okay, I think that's enough. And make sure that you're tilting it. I'm not really tilting it, but going like this because that's just not gonna work so mine just like automatically like let me turn off the lights here in my kitchen you could probably see it but yeah so the purple and blue and purple and in the back it kind of messed up so i don't recommend doing this all the time because it's gonna mix colors so let me turn back the light on since you already know how the colors look like I just tilt it back up here. Put back in the funnel. Put blue in there this time. And I don't really care how the colors like mix with each other. I just like the art aspect. It. There you go. So I think that looks better. That looks better. I think I'm gonna do more blue because. It doesn't really look good. I'm doing it side to side. Okay, so I did no mine. Let me just put that back. <laughs> okay, so this is how it looks like. It kind of looks like zebra stripes for me. Okay. So just to tip that I'm probably not going to do all these, but I, I don't know. I'm probably going to do like two. I'm going to do this little one and a bigger one. I think I might do this twisted one, this twisted bottle one. I don't know. I'm going to show you all the like, different styles of the cups at the end of the video. So let's get back into this. So we're going to do purple. This time, I'm going to cut it a little bit bigger because the blue has a bigger bottle, I mean a bigger hole than the purple. So I'm going to put this in. Hold the cup. Okay, that's not enough purple. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. So that's how it looks like. Okay, so this is how it looks like so far. And then it says to later set it down for like five to ten minutes. So then it'll settle down. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna do blue next. I'm gonna just skip this entire thing later. So then later you can see the finishing touch. So right now you already see how it looks like from afar. So I'm gonna skip to the end of the finale of the ending or finale or this hard thing so Ta -da! I finished okay so this is the finishing look you can see from afar a little but I might have to turn off the light so here is the finishing touch so it has like more purple than blue but here it has more blue than purple so it's kind of a cool thing so I'm gonna just go like that, tap out all the extra extra colors I have in the funnel so it doesn't ruin all of the all of the other ones that I might do. So here is the finishing touch. I'm gonna just wait. Okay, this is the finishing touch. I recommend using a paper towel or a paper, I mean, something with paper so that you don't ruin your desktop or ruin your work, workplace, workplace desktop. Why did I say that? But anyways, to, so you don't ruin your workspace. And I know it looks like God is like, angels coming all over my head it looks really weird i don't know what it's like shaping my head okay there you go you can see my head now so it doesn't look all deformed and my arms look weird okay you know what i'm gonna fix that lighting so i'll be back okay it really hasn't changed a bit right now but you're just gonna have to deal with it anyways <laughs> so here's my finishing colors so then again, it's for you for hanging it on the wall because it has a hole there. Let me turn back on the lights. Okay, next one. Hey. Okay, um, I figured out what this is for. It's for the little string so you can hang it on the wall. So, I'm going to take out one of the colors. I'm going to take out yellow because it's like... Wait, no, that's for the star. I'm going to use yellow for the star. Right now, I'm going to use pink to represent the color of a heart. It's really red, but there's no red here. So, I'm going to use part pink. Let me try to take this out. So, yeah, and I'm going to use this. It really is hard to take out stuff because it's like, great, now I just took out orange. I am failing at life miserably. Okay, so I'm going to take this out. I can't even take out a string. What is life right now? Okay, okay, I'm taking it out. Turns out it's different colors. Different colors, guys. Different colors. Okay, so. If you hear noise in the background, that's my brother. So, I think I'm going to use green mixed with blue because it kind of looks like a pretty color. But then again, I want to use pink. 
I'm just gonna use this color right here as pink and purple mix with each other. You can see it right here. It's pink, pink and then purple. So I'm only gonna cut a little bit right up to there, not right up to here. Yeah, this is hard. Okay, so I finally cut that. Oh, there's one string left. Okay, so let me put this. Okay, let me put this one away. Where did it go? Oh, wait, there it is. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. So this little thing right here, I'm going to put it in there, and then I'm going to tie it, I tie it up, Okay, so I'm almost there. Okay, so here is a finishing one. I can hang it up on a wall. It looks pretty cool too. So I'm gonna put this away. Probably settle down for like already six minutes. So I have four minutes left. Okay, so the next one I'm going to do, and the last one is this one because I really don't want to waste a lot of time on this. Wow. Anyways, I don't want to waste a lot of time. I'm already at 12 minutes, and it takes a long time to upload. And it's a very complicated process for me, so I'm going to use pink. If you pink, I'm already going to cut it because I don't want to waste time. Um, and I'm going to use green. Okay. I'm going to put the funnel in. Funnel in. And I think I'm going to tilt it. So then it will look pretty cool. So I'm going to use pink. Duh. I need to use the filter thing. Yeah. Pretty much taking a rolling process since I wanted to tilt. Okay. Now this side, this green, okay, and there's a purple, I mean pink, why am I saying purple? Here is what's going on right now. You can barely see the green. Here too. There's only a, a stride of green right there. So the next thing I'm going to do since the green is pretty much gone. I'm going to use... I want to just go like this. I want it to be the, the damage color. So I'll be that. I'll do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so right now, this is how it looks like. It looks like a candy. Okay, so I'm going to do this. It kind of looks like those twisted candies. And, yeah, so. I don't know what it reminds me of. I think the candies. But there's something else that I remember here for some reason. It looks really, really cool. I 
Oh no, no, I tilted it back, no. And if you lose some sand, it's okay because that looks like a really cool thing. I'll show you what it means. Losing sand is pretty much not okay, actually. I don't know why I said that, but for me, the napkin looks really, really cool. That's why I said it. So I'm gonna tilt the pink because of how the thing looks like. Okay, so that's how it looks like so far. Wait, turn off the light. Oh no. Okay, so this is how it looks like. Okay, so I have to finish with this. It's a very, very long. I'm already on 16 minutes. I have to finish this up. Okay, so I think I got a design going on now. Okay, so I just messed up the green, but for me, that's okay. All I'm going to do is do it like this. We're okay now. So I'm just going to put back in the green. I got an idea to put in the funnel. I had to figure this out. So I'll see you guys right now. Okay, I think I fixed it. Right here you can see I really didn't fix it, but I put in the remaining color because who really cares? I'm not even going to reuse green anymore. And I'm just going to fill this up because I have no more time. I'm already probably on 20 minutes, no 18. So yeah. I mm. don't really know what to do right now, but I'm just going to do it. Who cares? Okay, so I kind of messed up, but for me that's okay, because it's for me, not for anybody else. Plus I'm not even going to use pink anyway. So here you go, here's the thing. I'm going to put back the top with the piece colors away. Where's the top? Here it is. So back the top and here's the designs 
So, how am I two D sorry? So yeah, I finished. Okay, what I was gonna show you was these ones. So here's a diamond one. It kind of looks like a diamond because it's the way it's shaped. And here is the another one, the same one that we were just doing. Here's the triangle one I was showing. It's kind of rounded. And here is the shooting star one. I will do this later, but by myself because since I already reviewed them to you, you already know what it is. What it is. So if you see it in a store or something, you know how you're supposed to use it. So that's pretty much the meaning of this series that I'm going to do. Probably not going to last long though. So, um, <laughs> so, um, uh, yeah, it's probably not going to last long. I'm probably going to, um, ask my brother if he wants to, um, do one with me. But I don't know if he'll do it. But, yeah. Um, let me fix my stuff. So I'm gonna use the use the use. So guys, the reason I paused it, okay. You know what? I'm super dark right now. Okay. So the reason I paused it was because my grandma was there. She was like making a lot of noise. But um, yeah. And um, she didn't know I was making a video, so that's why I paused it. And since I already showed you the cut, you already know what it is. So I actually have this one right now, and it's really kind of cool. And I don't think I put it in for 10 minutes because it's already colliding. But it's a pretty cool color. So, yeah. Okay, so this is a llama box. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want me to do a singing video. Uh, reacting video? No, not a reacting video. Um, I don't know, but keep in the comments if I did good or bad. Hi! Okay, guys, I'm gonna show you my cat, okay? He just showed up out of nowhere. He he knew I was here. He's like my, my brother. He's like my, 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 my little son. So, here's my cat. Leo, say hi. Hi. He loves me a lot, even though I scared him once. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But he loves when I pet him. He's very lovable. But yeah, anyways, about the the video. So please like, comment, and subscribe. Comment if I did good or bad, and if you have any any advice for me for my to like make my videos better, like make music or make like a good intro. And yeah, please like, comment, and. Guys, thanks. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.